Hello, my name is Gertrude and I'm a developer advocate in the developer relations team at the park. In this video, I will be introducing you to Reload Tasks API. Now, this API is used for handling crude operations of Reload Tasks. Before you can begin interacting with this API, there are two important considerations you need to make. That is, you need a professional license as well as tenant admin role or developer role. And the two roles have different privileges. Let's get started. Let's begin by looking at documentation on click.dev. Navigate to APIs and search for reload tasks. These are our current operations as well as endpoints. For this video, I will focus on creating a task for a specified app using Click CLI. If you let's say wanted to update a task, you would need admin privileges. I will now look at the documentation as I did on click.dev but using the command line and I will use the help flag to get this at the end of the command. Since I want to create, I will go into details of the create command using the help flag again. I will need the app ID the recurrence as well as time zone, but feel free to add as much information and details as you want to create this scheduled reload task. In order for me to create the reload task for the specified app, I will first list the apps that I have access to. If you already know the app ID that you want to create a reload task for, you do not have to do this. And then I just copy pasted all the flags that I need in order to achieve this. And now I will change the app ID to the specified app that I want to create the reload task for. And that's the reload task demo video that I had previously created. I paste in the app ID, add the verbose, in order for me to get uh, extra information. And now the reload task has been created. That's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to let us know what you think and follow us on Twitter for more updates. Bye for now.